Hi, how are you? Hi, nice to meet you. I'm Scott Pack. I'm with a Nissan product planning for the Rogue. Okay. Uh, and again, so with a different demonstration here for the Rogue, what is it, this one? So this is active ride control. You've probably driven the active trace. So this is uh, kind of one of the additional features on our um, improved chassis dynamics. Uh, what you're going to feel here is when you, when you take a bump and the system kicks in at, when you're at over 25 miles an hour, after you take that bump, it really helps on the recovery, on that secondary bounce. So it doesn't bounce up that exactly. hard. Exactly. So it's using a combination of the, the throttle and the brake to smooth out that bump. And uh, all this is to make it a, a more comfortable ride, but also exactly. there's some safety involved into this, right? Yeah, it, it's more on the, uh, the the secure feeling, the confident driving. We're not uh, trying to make a, um, any radical changes in the uh, any uh, timed metrics uh, yeah. on the drive, but... But that, that, that more secure feeling makes the driver actually safer because exactly. when, when you panic at something that's happening, like right. maybe you, come, you, you make another mistake. Right. We, we talk about security. We talk about confidence. We make the okay. driver feel confident. So, I guess seatbelt, right? Yep. <laughs> <laughs> that would be good. So, we have three speed bumps here. You're going to take them at 15, 20, and 25. And again, the system doesn't kick in until 25. So the first two bumps are really to demonstrate the overall chassis and the vehicle itself. So like in the first two, we're not gonna feel any right. anything yeah, if you from... Right, just one second. Oops, sorry. If you wanna turn the, uh, the VDC off, right the top left, top left. No. Yeah, so that'll disable the system. Push it one more time. Yeah, so that'll uh, disable the system. You see the no, light. it's okay. So we'll, we'll run it through once this way. At we'll what turn speed? It back on. So it's 15 on the first one, 20, and then 25. Okay. So watch your speed on the first one. People have been... So that's 15. Yeah. So yeah, it, it pitches a lot more. Yeah. Wow. And 25. Okay. Okay, so we're going to go back and turn it back on and run through that again. And again, do this one. Now with the system on? Right. So we turn this on. Yep. And do we have uh, to click into the system or it's already, no, it's it's already always on. on by default? Yep. On this one. So you really feel it on the third bump. And at this one. Oh yeah, much more smooth. Yeah, it just really soaks it up. Uh, and that's the suspension and what other systems are involved in No, this? it's not the suspension. It's it's um, it's just the throttle and the, the brakes that's doing that. And it's using the existing sensors uh, that's monitoring wheel speed and the pitch and the yaw, all that combined going into one central controller and it's manipulating the throttle and the brake. So nothing to do with the suspension. Wow, it's pretty amazing. You can get similar feels off of kind of expensive uh, active suspensions that other vehicles have. And this is part of a package that goes on a, it's an addition or no, it comes standard, standard on every on single, single model? 100%. Wow. Thank you very much. Thank you. Very impressive.